Hello guys, how's it going? This is the easiest way I found how to bend an object in Blender. So let me show you. Let's add a cube. Let's scale it on X and Y. Something like that, maybe a little bit more on the X. Okay, so this is the front. So first, uh, let me add a uh, bunch of loop cuts. Let's go into edit mode with tab, control R. I'm going to add a bunch of loop cuts on this axis as well. Okay, let's go back into object mode and let's add a lattice modifier. And then shift A and then lattice. And it's really small, it's right there, but you can't see it. So let's scale it with S. And make sure it's outside the boundaries of the mesh. Let's scale it on Z. And then on X, SX, something like that. Okay, then select the object. And right here where it says object, select the lattice with the eyedropper. Click on the eyedropper and select the lattice. So the lattice shows up here. Now, Select the lattice again and go into the edit mode with tab and go into the lattice settings right here. As you see, the lattice has got two sides, two edges on each side, as you see. So we're going to have to subdivide it just like we did the mesh. So I want to bend it on, uh, on the y axis, so basically this way, kind of like that. I think it's this side, maybe. Yeah. So let's add a bunch of cuts right there. Okay, and I'm going to add a bunch of cuts on this side as well. Actually, I'm going to add only one, just one. Because I got a bunch of cuts on the mesh. I was uh, confused there. So anyway, uh, this is it. Basically, uh, let's go into the front view and uh, let's box select a bunch of them with B and you can either grab the gizmo or just uh, GZ something like that and rotator or whatever you want to do with it deselect everything B let's select these let's bring them down let's rotate them Deselect everything and then B again. And then bring them up. And then rotate it again. And so on. Yeah, I mean, you can do whatever you want with it. Okay, so we get something like that. Let's see it from the side, in the side view. And they select everything and then B and as you see when you select one side um, on the lattice uh, it selects everything basically uh, so yeah GZ to bring it up I guess something like that okay so if you are happy with your mesh the way it looks uh, go back into object mode and uh, select the mesh and of course apply the modifier and then select the lattice and just delete it and you'll have something like this the only bad side to this technique is that sometimes your model is pretty complex and you cannot do loop cuts just like we did here in a simple mesh like this 
So you kind of have to think in advance what you want to do. Or maybe you can make a separate object and add it to your mesh. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this one. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.